Well, hello, folks out there in YouTube land. Got a big reaction show. We're going to get all the SEC team's reaction to the decision of sticking with eight games for 2024. All right, I need a reaction. We're going to figure out how everybody feels after we've decided to go with the eight-game uh, schedule. And uh, I'm going to do this alphabetically for all you teams, okay? So I'm going to start out with the A's. We'll start out with Alabama. How do you feel? First of all, we're not afraid of anything. That's number one. Nick Saban's not afraid of a thing, and I don't want any more people talking about it anymore. We've won six national titles with him. I know he's won seven, but six only count because they were with us. So we're not taking any more of that crap. Georgia, it's not your turn. You wait. We'll, we'll get to you soon enough. I'm sick and tired of Georgia doing that. No more of that buck, buck, buck crap. You cut that crap out. Had our wide receiver not gotten his knee hurt, you wouldn't have won that national title two years ago, and you'd still be on the outside looking in. Buck, buck. All right, I've already told you once, Georgia, you get back in line. All right, now we've got Arkansas. Let's see, Arkansas, what do you have to say about it? Man, everything was going so good. I don't know what happened. Finish up three and five in the SEC last I just don't get it. Eight games, nine. Let's just stick with the eight. I don't care. We didn't. I just don't understand what happened. All right, Arkansas. I get it. I get it. Don't worry about it. You'll be better. You know, things were looking up there for you, but at least you had a winning record. Uh, next up, the Auburn Tigers with your new coach. Look, we are the only team other than that Tennessee team that has to play Alabama and Georgia every single year. How are we going to go to nine games? We got a new coach. It's his first year. We had to get rid of the old coach because he couldn't win. Two and six in the SEC. Oh, I should have kept my job. Yeah, two and six. Yeah, you definitely should have kept your job. Anyway, that's why we're at eight. And we're going to stick with eight until we get something squared away where we can have a decent schedule. All right, Auburn, that's fair enough. I can understand your point of view there. Oh, the Florida Gators. Let's see what the Gators have to say about it. Look, we're the Florida Gators. We've won a bunch of national titles, and I don't care what anybody says. Well, you've had two losing seasons in a row, Florida. Surely you've got an opinion on this eight-game thing. Yeah, I do. All right, Billy Napier is going to get it squared away, and I don't want to hear any more crap about that. He's going to be just fine. So let's stick with eight for the time being until we get a little better, okay? All right, that seems reasonable. I understand that. Now, nah, Georgia, it's your turn. What's that you say? You want to talk to the Georgia Bulldogs? <laughs> Two natties, baby. Hey, y'all only want to play eight games. Why don't we go to ten? You think we care who we play? We'll play every team in the SEC, and we'll play Ohio State and Michigan on top of that. What do you think about that? Now, Georgia, you're getting a little ahead of yourself. You know, you've had a couple of good years. I have to admit that, two natties. But, you know, it, things can turn on you. You know, you don't have that uh, offensive coordinator anymore, Todd Munkin. Munkin smunkin. We don't care about that. We're just going to keep on winning. Y'all want to stick with eight games, that's fine. We'll just go eight and oh. If you want to go nine, we'll go nine and oh. It's whatever you want to do. See ya. All right, next up, the Kentucky Wildcats. How do y'all feel about this? Look, we need to stick with eight for right now, okay? Now, we've had a couple of really good years with our boy Stoops, but uh, I'm not necessarily ready to go to nine. I think we're just fine where we're at. I'm worried about our basketball team. We only got seven players left right now. We got to pick up, what, six more? This offseason's been horrible. We need to be thinking about basketball. Well, that doesn't uh, surprise me any, Kentucky. I know what you care about. Anyway, all right, let's move on to a, an exciting team here, LSU. I know y'all are fired up. Hey, Coach Ogeron here. What you doing, Sports Talk J? I figured you'd want to talk to me. You want to talk about LSU Tigers? <laughs> you got to be talking to Coach O. Man, what is it you want to know? Eight or nine games, man. We ain't worried about playing no eight or nine down here in Louisiana, baby. We got the good players. You know we all good with Brian Kelly. and We ain't worried about how many games we play in the SEC. Sports Talk Jay, you need to come on down here and hang out for a couple of days, man. We'll hang out the bars. I'll get my good friend Chandelier to bring us some drinks, man. Everything will be good down here. Come on now. You know you want to hang out with old Coach O. All right, Coach O, appreciate your perspective. <laughs> yeah, always an interesting one. And, uh, let's move on. All right, now we're going to talk to Mississippi State. Yeah, um, eight or nine, whatever. I don't have our coach anymore. Not real happy. That's okay, Mississippi State. We're going to go right on. We understand. We all like Mike Leach, too. All right, so we got a new team we're going to talk to, and this is the Oklahoma Sooners. Hey, 
eight games, nine games. We don't care. We're coming on in. We were over there in the Big 12, and now we're in the SEC. We're ready to go. Let's go with nine games. It doesn't matter to us. <sighs> Whoever said nine games, what an idiot. Stick with eight. This conference is brutal, man. It's brutal. I never knew it'd be you. I should have stayed at the Big 12. Ugh. So mean. All right, I understand, Oklahoma. We tried to warn you. All right, let's see what Ole Miss is up to. Let's see what's going on with Ole Miss and see what they thought of the eight or nine. Lane Kiffin's talking to who? Are you Florida? What? Offer him some more money then. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry, What eight or nine, I don't, I'm too busy trying to keep our head coach squared away, okay? He's talking to who now? Nebraska? <sighs> I'm busy. I'll just, whatever y'all want to do, eight or nine. Lane, what are you doing? Lane, quit talking to everybody. Sorry about that, old Miss. I know it's not easy keeping a head coach. All right, let's move on to Missouri. All right, look. We're telling you we want to move to nine games, but in reality, we all know eight games is better for us. We got Eli Drinkwitz up here. He's talking smack and all. Look, eight games is plenty. We should have never come to the SEC. Oklahoma, Texas, you blew it. It's brutal over here. Anyway, eight's fine. We're going to pretend, say nine. That makes Eli feel good, but we're going to vote eight every time. All right, that makes sense. All right, South Carolina. Let's see what South Carolina has to say. Look, we need to stay with eight games. Nine games really doesn't make any sense. And the other thing is this. Do not bring Clemson into the SEC. I know they're struggling in the ACC, but whatever you do, do not bring Clemson in. Don't do that to us. If you do, we're going to the ACC. We cannot be in the same conference with them. Can't stand them. Okay, yeah, I kind of figured that. It's a bit of a, <laughs> a civil war over there in South Carolina between those two teams. Whew. All right. Our next team is Tennessee. Let's see what Tennessee has to say. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> 11 and 2 Orange Bowl champs. Eight, nine games. It doesn't matter. Just keep Josh Heupel here and everything will be fine. And oh, as for all the gimmick talk, they'll, everybody will be mimicking the gimmick in about five years after they realize it's the way to go. Eight, nine games. Doesn't matter. Do whatever you want to do. All right, Tennessee. I kind of figured you'd have that opinion. All right, now we're going to talk to our biggest new team, which is Texas. Let's see what the Longhorns have to say. Yep, when we come on down there, we're going to be whooping some tail and taking names. The big dog's coming in. Texas, whoop, whoop. Yeah. Uh-huh. You better hold on to your hats. Anybody got any Tylenol out there? This SEC's brutal, man. What's going on here? Oklahoma, where are you at? Why did we leave? We had it so made in the Big 12. Man, the crap. <sighs> anyway, let's stick with eight, man. <laughs> they were right on the eight. Ugh. All right, Texas, I kind of figured you'd go down that path too. Same as Oklahoma. It's all right. Look, everybody does that when they come in the SEC new. It's just the way it is. All right, now we've got Texas A&M, Texas's little brother. Let's see what they have to say, eight or nine. Anybody want a head coach? We got one for sale. One Jimbo Fisher. <laughs> Oh, gosh. We don't need to be going to nine games. We need to stick with eight. You know, we owe that guy 90 million bucks. You're never going to get rid of him. Ugh. And you bring Texas. You had to bring Texas in the SEC. Thanks a lot for that. I understand how you feel, South Carolina. I don't blame you a bit. All right, Texas A&M. I kind of understand that. I know in the same state that's, that's difficult. And let's talk to Vandy, lastly. See what they're up to. Look, we beat Kentucky and Florida last year. We're doing great. Stick with the eight. We don't need another loss on top of everything else. Eight games is fine. Just stay right there. Don't make us go to the ACC. Don't you do it. Yeah, I kind of figured you'd think that, Vandy. Really, the ACC, what? Well, Y'all probably do pretty well there, but really you ought to be in the Ivy League. But, you know, what the heck. So, anyway, I just thought it'd be good if we found out what all the various teams – would think and their reaction to the eight game versus the nine. And it's about what we thought. All right, folks, just thought we'd get a big reaction from all the different teams in the SEC. And if you like this content, be sure to hit that like button. That's meant to continue to cover the ACC and all that good stuff. And if you've not subscribed, it's right here on my right. No, wait, your right, my left. Just boom, hit that little button. I would appreciate it. Cost you nothing. Helps me out. And right over here is my most recent video. Be sure to check that one out. And we'll see you next time on Sports Talk Jay.